What is up guys? Welcome back to my channel and if you're new, hi, hello, welcome. My name is Grace, farmer, photographer, welder, and I'm YouTuber, I guess, and today we are cutting beans again. This is the fourth day of harvest. But before we get into this video, I have to tell you guys about the new way I've been earning cash back for free with the Upside app. As many of you have probably gathered by now, I travel a lot and the fuel prices in the last year, yikes. That's why I'm super excited to tell y'all about my new favorite way to save upside upside is an app that offsets inflated prices by giving you cash back on your purchases to get started download the free upside app use my promo code farmer grace and get an extra 25 cents off every gallon for your first tank of gas i already have it downloaded so let me show you how it works once it's downloaded open the app and claim an offer for whatever you're buying i usually use it when i'm buying fuel pay as usual with a credit or debit card follow the steps in the app and get paid with Upside, you can earn three times more cash back than credit card rewards or loyalty programs and cash out anytime to your bank account, PayPal, or with e-gift cards for awesome brands. I like to cash mine out to Starbucks to fuel my coffee addiction. <laughs> Upside users are earning hundreds of dollars every year and Upside won't sell your information to third parties. To get started, download the free Upside app and use my promo code FARMERGRACE to get an extra 25 cents off every gallon on your first tank of gas. Thank you to Upside for sponsoring today's video and thank you to all of you watching for making opportunities like this possible for me. Now let's get into the video. It's gonna turn the battery on and we should be good to go. All right, so let's get started. Jumped on the grain cart. We're gonna keep going. I'm trying to figure out how exactly I want to do this because there's ditches. And the field's not perfectly square, so it's kind of like at an angle like this. And there's ditches that run parallel to this side, and there's ditches that run parallel to this side, so it's kind of like corner. And you want to go straight along the ditches instead of like crossing them caddy corner. We're just gonna go for it. So I ran some errands this morning, and I went to Duncan. I was in my truck, so I had to um, shut it off whenever I got to the drive through window because I like they can't hear me. I order and I go to start it, and it starts to crank. It starts to crank, and then it just stops. Great, great, amazing. This long line behind me. It was busy today, um, so I had my sister get in the driver's seat, and I had her crank on it while I like wiggled the, some wires. It started. I was like, great, amazing, lovely. So I start walking back around to the driver's seat. This was my fault. I didn't tell her any different, but I left it in gear. She dumped the clutch, killed the truck, and almost killed me also. So we had to do it again. And at this point, the drive or the Duncan workers were coming outside. And one of them, he was so nice. And like this made my day. This restored my faith in humanity. When you get up in the drive through pull over and pop the hood and I'll clean the battery post for you. He literally cleaned it for me while I was sitting in the drive through Is that not the sweetest thing ever? He was so nice. So to the Duncan worker, if you're watching this video, I highly doubt it, but in the off chance that you are, thank you. Your kindness made my whole entire week. Thank God none of the Duncan workers were standing in front of the truck. Thank God, because that could have been bad. So we've been having some electrical issues with the with the 
combine, the same message pops up on my monitor. And nothing's wrong with the combine. Well, I mean, I'm sure the electrical problem, that's, that's not supposed to happen, but the combine's running fine. All right, we are done with this field. I'm gonna go ahead and get the bean head set on the cart and we will be ready to go to the next field and all we'll have to do is wait for dad to get back with an empty truck. I'm gonna clean under these belts because since I took that seal out, we need to keep it clean. Okay, now I'm gonna go back up there and I'm gonna turn the pressure on the head all the way up and then, uh, and then I'm gonna unhook everything and then we'll be ready to set it on the wagon. This shield right here, you always want to try and center it between the two back tires. That way, you know that the PTO shaft isn't going to rub on the tire. Okay, so we are at the next field. We got everything moved over here. Dad has either left or he's about to leave with another load. I'm going to open this field up. I just had it like a sandwich and it's stuck in between my teeth. I do not like that. So I'm trying to figure out how I want to come into the field. So the way that the grain car is parked right now, you can see like it's got a slant to the top of it. You're supposed to unload on the side that's slanted. As you can see, the side that's slanted is right up next to the field that I'm trying to go to. So I'm going to open the field up starting behind the grain cart to open up the side that I'm supposed to unload on. I hope that makes sense. I'm going to cut a couple um, right this way really quick and then I'm going to cut some across the front. I'm gonna unload onto the cart and then I'm gonna go up the side and come back. And then I'll open up this side and come back. I'm pretty sure this is the field that I filmed my first YouTube video in. So that's kind of cool. All right, let's get to it. Cheers. sure to shut the battery back off so we don't drain the battery. Look who found me. 
right after his mama. You said. You say hello. Say hi. I'm gonna attempt to roll the tarp on the grain cart. It's probably not gonna go very well. Now we're going to get the tarp on the truck. This old gal is ready to go. That is all for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to check out all my other social media accounts linked down below. And I'll talk to you guys next time. Bye.